What's up guys, Dr. Michael here and welcome to the channel today. I'm super excited and grateful for the new year and I hope you all are too. I want to quickly use this medium to give a massive shout out to my distinctive subscribers and viewers for what they did last year, the subscriber count, the views and everything. I want to appreciate you for finding what I do here, fun and entertaining. I really appreciate you and I'm looking forward to achieving more with you this Saturday. Year. Thank you and God bless you. I wish you all the good tidings and blessings this year has to offer. With all that being said, I'm going to kick off this spectacular year with a review of the Xiaomi Redmi Night Prime, a very distinctive phone in the market which has actually been in the market for some time now. It came out in 2020 but I'm going to be reviewing it here on the channel in 2021. I'll also be dropping more comparison videos with other Android and iOS devices on the channel too. So definitely stay tuned to the channel and if you're ready to be subscribed to the channel, I implore you to do that by clicking the subscribe button below this video and definitely turn on notification by clicking on the bell icon beside it. The Xiaomi Redmi 9 Prime is a rebranded version of the affordable Xiaomi Redmi 9 smartphone announced on the 4th of August 2020 and released on the 6th of the same month in China. The Redmi 9 Prime comes with similar specifications, design and other features as of the Redmi 9. The Redmi 9 Prime has a water drop notch offering a screen size of 6.53 inches IPS LCD display. The screen delivers a resolution of 1080 by 2340 pixels and 395 ppi density. It features 400 nits type peak brightness and the TUV certified screen is covered with a cunning Gorilla Glass strip. The Redmi 9 Prime also reaches 83.2% screen to body ratio. The Xiaomi Redmi 9 Prime measures 198 grams in weight, the same with the original Redmi 9. The budget smartphone wrapped with all plastic on the back and frame has a quad rear camera setup that includes a 30 megapixel f2.2 wide lens, 8 megapixel f2.2 ultra wide lens, a 5 megapixel f2.4 macro lens, and 2 megapixel depth assist lens. It also sports an 8 megapixel front camera for selfies and video calls. Camera modes on this phone include Pro Mode, Portrait, Short Video, and Slow Mo. As far as video quality is concerned, the Redmi 9 Prime delivers video in 1080p Full HD at 30 frames per second on both camera sides of the phone. Take a look at this. Hey guys, so I'm currently testing the selfie camera of the Xiaomi Realme 9 Prime. Let me know in the comment box what you think about the video quality and uh, the sound of course. Uh, this is the front camera of the Xiaomi Realme 9 Prime. The Xiaomi Redmi 9 Prime is powered by MediaTek Helio G80 chipset that has an octa-core processor clocking at 2.0 GHz, the same chipset as that of the Techno Pover, which was also released late last year. It has Mali G52 MC2 for graphics and runs on Android 10 operating system MIUI 11 on top. The phone is available in 64GB of storage plus 4GB of RAM and an higher-end 128GB of storage plus 6GB of RAM storage units which can be expanded using a microSD card. It's also available in 4 different colors which includes Space Blue, Mint Green, Sunrise Flare and lastly Matte Black which is the one I have right here. The Xiaomi Redmi 9 Prime packed the Monster 5020mAh non-removable battery that offers 2 days of battery life. The retail box comes with a 10 w USB Type-C charger and in order to enjoy a faster charge, you will have to purchase an 18 w rapid charger from Xiaomi stores or any other mobile accessory stores. Other cool features of the smartphone include the rear-mounted fingerprint sensor, dual SIMs with 4G LTE network, wireless FM radio with no need for wired phones, Wi-Fi 802.11 AC, Bluetooth 5.0, 1217 linear speaker, infrared port, anti-fingerprint ripple texture for better grip, USB Type-C port, 3.5mm headphone jack and you also get a rubber protective case in the retail package. The Xiaomi Redmi 9 Prime is available for $135 for the base storage model 
and $160 for the higher end model. In Nigeria, price for the Xiaomi Redmi 9 Prime ranges from 65,000 Naira to 77,000 Naira or more due to the currency rates and in India, price ranges from 10,000 to 12,000 Indian rupees which makes it an ideal affordable smartphone in 2021. So if you have previously thought of getting a decent and affordable phone, you can definitely go for this one as it's worth every penny you would invest in getting it. And about its relevance in 2021, I can averagely assure you of its performance, battery life and cameras which are great. So yeah, that's pretty much everything for the review. Thanks for watching till this end. I hope you enjoyed this video. If so, hit the like button below. And like I said earlier, I'll be dropping more videos about this phone and even other Android and iOS devices on the channel. Do all to be subscribed and make sure to turn on notifications to be notified when I eventually drop a new video. Thanks for watching once again. Until then, peace.